The sun shines on Brock Hecking. It's May, and his senior football season is months away. Hecking is one of the most feared defensive players in the Mountain West Conference. I mean, look at him. But the truth of the matter is, he started from the bottom like many did. Uh, growing up, I was usually a smaller kid. Uh, going through high school, freshman year, I was about you know, 132 pounds. That's why I wrestled. And then everyone was always, you know, told me that I was too small, small to play college football. And so year after year, you know, I just focused on my diet and you know, working out hard in the weight room and whatnot. And you know, sooner or later, by my senior year, I was about 240. Now that it's the off season, Brock says this is his home. The Nevada Athletic Weight Room. Five, th five days a week. Take Wednesdays off usually. And then I'll be here on Saturday too. All of the extra effort here means better performance here. And for the people who doubted him, I don't really say anything to them actually. I just kind of let my actions speak for themselves. You know, I'm not going to go rub in their face or anything. It, they were my motivation though, you know. People telling me not, you know, that I can't do it basically motivated me and got me to where I am. So where exactly is he at? Last season, he had 46 total tackles and nine vicious sacks. But despite the impressive record, he says it's all about the team. It's more of a brotherhood than it is actual one person who's leading. Of course, Hacking considers his fellow players his brothers and Mackey Stadium his home away from home. In fact, this place can hold 30,000 people. Brock, what do you feel when you walk onto this field and you see every seat packed with fans, with crazy, battle-ready, battle-born fans? You know, we, when we line up in that tunnel, it's, you know, we build this energy. And, you know, I like to be calm right before the game, but then right when I hit that tunnel, it's like an instant shot of adrenaline. You know, you just start getting pumped, you start getting hyped. Man, I get goosebumps before every single <laughs> game that I play. And you know, we run out and I look out and I see the support of the community and how many people are out here. And it really just motivates me and just drives me to be the best that I could be out here. You know, I want to put on a show for them as well as, you know, bringing home the W for the team. He says he's built many lifelong relationships with the people, the players and the coaches at Nevada. And he doesn't take anything for granted. You, know, you never know when your time's up playing college football, I mean, playing football in general. So you got to make the most of it. But luckily for Hecking, his time is not up. With the senior season getting ready, he's thankful for the opportunity he's been given. I just want, you know, people to kind of remember me as, you know, uh, kind of the guy who loved football, I guess you can say, that was 100% dedicated to the sport, never took a playoff during a game, and really just played like my hair was on fire all the time. To see Hecking, his hair, and the rest of the pack, you still have to wait a little bit. Kickoff is set for August 30th against Southern Utah. Reporting from the University, I'm Leo Bias.